we're switching gears completely. A lot of folks not happy about this. Another Fox News alert. Outrage of a dramatic new video of American sailors on their knees surrendering to Iranian troops. A commander even forced to apologize. Garrett Tenney's live force in Washington with the fallout this morning. Good morning, Garrett. Good morning, Heather. Just hours after releasing those 10 U.S. Navy sailors, Iranian state TV released this video allegedly of the sailors being detained by Iran's Revolutionary Guard on Tuesday. You can see them there on their knees, hands behind their heads, as Iranian soldiers stand by with their guns. And then in another clip showing the sailors during their captivity, a U.S. sailor identified as the commander apologizes for the entire incident. It was a mistake. That was our fault, and we apologize for our mistake. The Iranian behavior was fantastic while we were here. We thank you very much for your hospitality and your assistance. I didn't have a special problem. We had no problem, sir. U.S. officials are now working to determine if that video is in fact authentic and to understand the circumstances surrounding it. But if it is the real deal, those images would be clear violations of the Geneva Convention, which prohibits taking pictures of prisoners of war. Iran's Revolutionary Guard explained the sailors' release with this statement, saying, The U.S. Marines who entered Iran's territorial waters yesterday were released because it has become clear that their entry was not intentional and after they apologized for the move. Exactly how they ended up in the waters is still under investigation by U.S. officials, but the Obama administration is celebrating the release of the sailors and using the incident to promote the benefits of the nuclear deal negotiations, which helped cultivate, cultivate more open lines of communication. I also want to thank the Iranian authorities for their cooperation. I think we can all imagine how a similar situation might have played out three or four years ago. Today, uh, this kind of issue was able to be peacefully resolved and efficiently resolved. Many U.S. lawmakers, though, are saying Iran is using the video and the entire incident as propaganda to tout their military might and to undermine American influence in the region. Heather? Garrett Tenney live for us. Thank you, Garrett.